Very warm welcome from ourselves, Sheldon Peters. We'll be racing on the poly track on Monday, the 23rd of August, Hollywood Bets Gravel. So kicking off the week, Monday, we had Hollywood Bets Gravel on the poly track, eight race program, looking forward to the proceedings. Race number one, due off at 12.35, the bipod will commence straight off, so get those bipods off in the first race, download the race card online, www.goldcircle.co.za, maiden plate over 1,000 metres. The anti-post betting sees Anton Marcus looking to get back into the winner's box. Of course, Saturday he ended the meeting with his first winner after the break. He came back with a little bit naughty to win. And he'll be looking to kick off from where he left off with number 8, Ancient Epic. The Vercingetrix from the Gareth Van Zale stable priced up 7 to 10 in the anti-post market, ahead of number 2, Casa Rosada at 9 to 2, and then you have a horse like number 3, Corner Crusade, who's trading at 7 to 1, and you can get 7 to 1 and better the balance. As far as the selection goes, number 8, Ancient Epic, after three very good runs to date, does set the standard, drawn out at 8, but Anton Marcus will have a game plan, Unfortunately, last time out was a little bit slow into stride and had to go to plan B and C. Did run on the poly track first time out, and with the natural improvement, lack of opposition, number eight, Ancient Epic, although I don't like, I don't like going with the odds on in a big way, does look to be tough to beat in the opener, forms a bipod banker. Second selection, I will go with number two, Casa Rosada. The more experienced, the four-year-old, had the one run here in KwaZulu-Natal, was not disgraced on that occasion when finishing fourth behind backstop. Now the form line of that race, we're going to have to wait and see, and see if it works out. Wasn't the strongest of fields on that occasion, but number two, Casa Rosada, will be the second selection. Then a little bit of value, number seven, Future Princess. Now, when you look at Future Princess, you're going to say no form to recommend. Was beaten over 10 lengths on debut and then ran in a little feature next time out to 21 lengths behind. The reason I'm selecting number 7, Future Princess, is the drop to the 1,000. The debut is over 1,200 metres. The second run, they put the blinkers on, went over the 1,300 metre trip. I think back to 1,000, the pace that they that showed on the first two runs, I think that number seven, Future Princess, could be an exact inclusion at a nice price around 14 and 16 to 1. And then we're going to go with number three, Corner Crusade, for the fourth selection. The favourite does look tough to beat, and Anton Marcus should open proceedings. Okay.